And I think it's a pity if we don't take advantage of the extraordinary human personal experiences that each one of us has had to go just a little beyond the, the kinds of debates. And, and I'm looking at you, Silke, because of, of a very intense, very intense uh, query that I have. Uh, you were in struggle, I was in struggle. Uh, I have nothing but admiration for the willingness of somebody from a relatively privileged background in a comfortable country saying that I am going to devote my life, my body, my energy for a cause I believe in, uh, and doing that and paying quite a heavy kind of a price. Uh, how do you feel now about the actions that, that you were involved in? I mean. Not, not the courage part, and, and you know, it was at the time of the Vietnam War, the time when governments were colluding and so on, but, but the power of self-reflection that we have, how would you feel today? Well, to tell you the truth, it's not, um, it was not the right course at the moment, and, uh, and I, I'm, I'm more concerned, I know that I, I started out with a high moral feeling of being on the side of those who who were um, bombed at that time in, during Vietnam, so it was on that reason. But I found out later that um, the justification to murder other people brings you closer to those who who already who who do the killing in the first place. And it it's, it's not an end, but it's an escalation of what uh, what um, yeah it it. it it goes on and on and on.